All right, we are in the post-match press conference after a first-round uh, match between University of Wisconsin Whitewater and Ohio Northern University, joined by Whitewater head coach Stacy Boudreau, uh, senior libero Brittany Robinson, and on her left, freshman outside Aaron McNeil. And uh, coach, if you could give an opening statement on what you saw in the match tonight, um, one in three sets, including coming from behind there in the third set. Um, well, I definitely want to give credit to Ohio Northern. Um, they did a great job, really served us um, aggressively all night. Um, kind of got us a little more out of system that last set. Um, and defensively, I thought they did a great job picking up a lot. So um, I, I think it was a great match. I think my team really fought hard, went out, and executed well. Um, I thought we handled some of those serving runs really, really well and um, just really did a great job. Our game plan was to kind of force our middles. I thought we did a great job of that. We were able to get our middles quite a few attempts, and I thought that they were very successful. So um, excited to be here and um, really proud of, of this team. Uh, as a senior, Brittany, um, talk a little bit about what it means to not only be in the tournament, but to move on to the second round. Um, keep playing and uh, playing well like you did tonight. Yeah, so um, we actually had the opportunity to be in the tournament my freshman and sophomore year. We got to host regionals at home, so this is a whole new experience for us. Nobody on the team currently has ever experienced a regional outside of our home gym. So it's been um, really exciting to have the experience at a completely different school. Um, Calvin has great facilities, so it's really cool to be here. And just to move on um, to the next round is super exciting because it's something that we haven't experienced in sophomore year. So. To miss it last year, it was really tough for us, to be, but to be able to be back here um, again is just an amazing feeling, and then to have such a good first round win is awesome too. Aaron, uh, you were part of a pretty strong uh, front row attack there, and uh, you guys have a lot of size there up front, and uh, you're part of that. Just talk a little bit about uh, how you guys try to go after things from an offensive perspective. Yeah, I think that's one of the biggest advantages of, of our team is just the big block that we have and um, the block our middles put up. But the size definitely helps us in every game. Can't go wrong with that. <laughs> and it's just a big advantage of our team. Coach, um, one of the previous coaches here was talking about how uh, good defense fuels offense and good offense fuels defense. Could you expound on that a little bit more? It seemed like your team was uh, getting both to work pretty well tonight. and. Uh, they really do feed off each other, don't they? Yeah, absolutely. I think we've been very balanced in both aspects of the game, um, really all season. Um, having a great front line, but then obviously having an amazing backcourt as well. Our libero, Brittany, here had 33 digs, and that is very, very impressive in, in three sets. So um, yeah, I think we really executed defensively very well, um, which then in turn um, helps out our offense tremendously. Coach, I'll ask you this question, and maybe your players can answer the same one, but you played a very uh, rugged schedule, I guess is the best way I would put it, and uh, I'm sure that's helped prepare you for moments like this. In your mind, how has your tough uh, regular season, as far as the schedule is concerned, helped you uh, going forward into the postseason? Well, I think it's there's no surprises. You know, we've faced um, a lot of the tough teams in the nation, and um, obviously, that was on purpose. You know, we definitely wanted to get our SOS up higher this year um, to obviously help us with that um, at-large bid as well. And um, it's, it's only prepared our team. You know, we've seen um, a lot of these teams at this regional. This isn't even our region. You know, we kind of got moved into here, and we've seen a lot of these teams already. So um, I think that's definitely a big advantage. But um, you know, in turn, they've seen us as well. So um, I think. Definitely um, tomorrow, whoever we're playing, it's, it's going to be a battle. Brittany and then Aaron, same, uh, oops, same questions for you. Yeah, so um, playing that like tough strength of schedule definitely helped us because we've been in all of those pressure situations. There's a lot of times where we have the target on our back, but when we play a team that might be you know stronger than us in the rankings or whatever, they have the target on theirs, and it's always, it's always cool to go out there and play a team that you know is super strong, and I think it really helped us prepare for this match especially because we hadn't played Ohio Northern. It's really the only team in the region that we haven't played, so we get a different look at a whole new team, but um, going down in that third set, I think just playing those strong teams this year and like maybe being in some of those pressure situations definitely helped us push to come back from 
they were up, I think, I don't even know, I think they had game point and we came back and won that one. So I definitely think like playing those tough teams all year has helped us to be able to um, kind of just stay composed in those pressure situations. Yep, I think our schedule has definitely helped us in these moments right now that really matter to us and obviously going forward in the tournament, that's just going to be an advantage for us. Coach, uh, final question here. Um, your thoughts on playing tomorrow night? Um, don't know the opponent yet, but uh, you're playing in the second round. Um, how do you prepare for this one? Um, well, right now we'll enjoy for a little bit here. We'll uh, get these players um, some supper, and um, and then we're gonna we're gonna move on. And we're gonna focus. We're obviously gonna be watching some of the match uh, tonight, and um, I'm sure the coaches will be up late watching film and getting prepped. And I'm hoping their athletes will be getting some rest and. Um, hopefully recovering from tonight's match. So, All right, very good. Congrats, and uh, we'll see you tomorrow. All right, thank, thank you. you.